the huge vortices of energy created by our technologies. The huge vortices of energy created by our technologies. The huge vortices of energy created by our technologies present us with unfathomable consequences. Put a decent man in an airplane a few hundred feet above a village, and he will kill without compunction, inflict appalling pain and injury on men, women, and children. That bomber pilot is really very much like the person introducing any new technology. None of these people ever consider what will be the impact or the effect of what they do when they pull that trigger. We cannot trust our instincts or our natural physical responses to new things. They will destroy us. How are we to get out of the maelstrom created by your own ingenuity? Edgar Allan Poe has a story called The Descent into the Maelstrom. With all hope lost, I found myself idly studying the action of the vortex. Some objects did not fall, but were whirled up to the level of the sea. There it lay my salvation. I tied myself to an old steamer trunk and I abandoned my doomed ship. Thus did I free myself from oblivion. The huge vortices of energy created by our media present us with similar possibilities of evasion, of consequences, of destruction. By studying the pattern of the effects of this huge vortex of energy that, in which we're involved, it may be possible to program a strategy of evasion and survival.